Hello, everybody. Welcome back today with IJR Racing, and uh, today we're going to be doing a uh, six-lap cup on a Monza. So, without any further ado, let's get started, shall we? This is a nice little uh, car to drive. I only have nine upgrades on it, but but I will say it doesn't have the best grip and uh, you know stuff like that. But it is it is a fun little a fun car to drive. Yeah, you could win this car in Red Line Origins. Yeah, just make sure that you have enough, um, you have a lot of gold and racing dollars. I don't know, somewhere around like 300 gold, maybe. Maybe about. Like two or three million racing dollars. I'd say two million is fine, but three just to be safe. We have a big update coming here uh, next week, probably. The uh, Formula E update. I don't actually like Formula E on the game. I think it's really cool in real life, but I just it, it's just not fun on the game at all. I mean, the cars. It's just like like the sound out here. They just screech and and they don't go too fast. And and the tracks. I know there's only two Formula E tracks, but the tracks are just so tight, and you can never you can never just like get around the corner. Right? You have to brake constantly. But of course, there'll be like a another car in the update, another car or two. So. Besides the Formula E cars, hopefully, so it'll be interesting to see what that is, and then we'll have a um, exclusive series, and of course the flashback events. So you know, if the two new ones don't really interest you that much, or you can't really do them, there's always the flashback events. So that's good to have. It's a shame you can't customize any of the Ferraris anymore. I know a long time ago you were able to do it, but ever since an update, I don't remember which one. But yeah, you couldn't uh, customize them anymore. So I don't know if they're ever going to bring the customization back or anything, but it would be nice in the next update if they brought the customization back.
I like how his uh, little uh, jumpsuit is red. That's a nice touch. Well, well, we didn't win, but second's not too far off. Plus, I've already won this race, so it's not going to affect me that much. Oh yeah, I just uh, 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 went to level 106 uh, last night. This car does take a long time to service. I need a lot more upgrades. A lot of them are gold. I think one right now is just for racing dollars. Yeah, yeah, suppression. I mean, uh, suspension. Sorry. Drivetrain, engine. I'm sure after you do all these gold upgrades, the next ones are gonna be racing dollars. So, for those of you who don't already, who don't already, I don't already have the car. I still have a long way to go on this thing. I'm nowhere near complete. Yeah, there's a. It's not really a separate paint job, it's just the number 12, which is really cool. I think. If you can change the numbers, but. You, you can't. And honestly, it would just be worth it just to fully, uh, to fully upgrade the car. Rather than, than just spend 28 gold to do this paint job. If you ask me. Well, alright guys, that wraps it up for this video. Um, I look forward to seeing what there is on the next update. And, um, and uh, have a happy... Happy pursuit on whatever you are going after in the game, and I'll see you guys on the next video.